there a reason for that or something to, to point to as to why that is? Yeah, I wish I knew the reason. If I could pinpoint it, we wouldn't have them. But uh, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Maybe we need to have the mindset of on the road in order to do it home. But we definitely need to take care of home a lot better than we do. Alan, what's it like when you hear the crowd chanting, let's go Celtics, end of the game, and stuff like that? I mean, you know, our crowd is, you know, sometimes they with us, sometimes they're not. So, I mean, when we're playing like that, I mean, what you know what you expect. We gotta gotta get better performance. Alan, it was right around this time last year and you guys were kinda of hitting your stride and getting yeah. the playoffs. What's changed between this year and last year? What's different now Different team. <coughs> different team. Um, different team. Different team. Different coaching staff is different. You know what I mean, but we still have the guys, you know, to get the job done. We just gotta you know, do it. No. It wasn't just one game, you know, like it normally is when you lose to a team. You, know, you fall back one game in the standings. This was actually two because of the tiebreaker. You know, now they have the tiebreaker. Um, same one thing with Charlotte. Even though I think they have a better record against the, the conference than us, so. I mean, these are all big games. We knew that coming in. We knew that we looked at you know, the schedule when you see the stretch, and we had you know, like five, five games against teams that are right in front of us. And, you know, we gave one up to, to Miami. We gave one up tonight to them. You know, we were able to play, you know, good the previous two games, but I mean, all these games really matter. And so, uh, you know, it's definitely a tough loss. Second half, uh, fourth quarter got, I think, about 16 points there. What do you, what do you think happened in the second half? We guys been able to kind of just close the gap there and get on top of them? I mean, we, they just made plays, you know, uh, especially down the stretch. They ran that pick and roll play. It was kind of giving us a lot of problems. We just couldn't, couldn't get a stop, couldn't get a rebound. And we didn't make shots tonight, you know. As a team, we didn't make shots. I thought uh, we were a little selfish at times, um, you know, not making extra passes. But we still had open looks, and we didn't make them. What specifically the pick and roll was going to be? I don't know. They just... just they posed a matchup problem tonight for us, I think. Um, you know, they, they went small a lot and you know, they were roll, running pick and rolls and we were kind of getting indecisive on switching or not and then our, our tag man wasn't there. And we were just getting layups and dunks and you know, wide open shots. Uh, playing at home, you guys have been not that well this season. Well, I don't know why I'm for you guys. I, don't know. <laughs> I yeah. wish I did, man. I honestly do. Um, at home? Yeah. Um, you know, that's one of the many, I think, with this team. You know, we felt like coming into the season, we've been a lot better than we are now. You know, where we are now. So, you know, home definitely, you know, that, that definitely stands so we can't, you know, give our fans something to cheer about. You know, the reason to get excited about games and coming to games. Um, and it kind of put, puts a damper on things. You came up a rebound short. Is it a rebound? Rebound short, which was rebound one. Short, yeah. Your first triple double is that in your mind at all? No, I don't, you know, I lost. You know, I definitely triple double is a, is a great feat, but, you know, um, you lose it. Where does it come from? Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Yep. Mark yourselves at home on top of that. Yeah, it was tough. Uh, you know, I think it just, you know, came down. We didn't knock shots down, and they did. You know, I thought I shot ourselves in the foot uh, early in the second half. I took three pretty quick ones, and their lead, lead extended. But uh, we got pretty much the same situation uh, coming up in Charlotte, so we can do it over again. Uh, and then defensively, what do you think happened to you guys, especially in the second half there? It seemed like a pick and roll that kind of killing us with that play. Yeah, uh, you know, they, they read us well and uh, kind of... Uh, Took whatever we uh, didn't take away. Uh, why do you think the team struggles so much at home? Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 it goes against a lot of Yeah, it's bizarre, right? It's it's bizarre. I don't know. Um, it's the way it is right now. You know, uh, I'm not going to discredit us. I thought we were out there. Fighting, putting in a good effort. It just didn't go our way tonight. How much uh, of, a, of a problem is the pick and roll defense at this point? Is this something that just happened a couple times, or is this a growing problem? Do you think? Uh, well, it just de <coughs> depend on the team. Uh, you know, I think you know, give Boston a lot of credit. You know, the big guys that they have, you know, can just flat out shoot it and. Uh, 
you know, he shot the, the ball well tonight, even the three. So, uh, you know, yeah, it was tough for us tonight. John, I'm sure I lost this thing, but considering you guys had a couple of nice wins, everything we're home, what this game meant to you guys, how much is this lost thing tonight? Uh, it hurts because obviously we want to come out, we want to, uh, you know, win this game. You know, we understand where we are in the standards and, you know, to, to, to keep climbing. You know, this was a game that uh, we had to, you know, be better. If we were to be so, uh, I thought we had two you know, great, tough wins, and you know, for for whatever reason, uh, you know, we were just. I mean, other than pretty much the first quarter, we were pretty flat the rest of the game. Has that been a problem at times this year, though? I mean, you guys are one of the better <coughs> first quarter teams. It seems like um, keeping that energy up for, for three more quarters. Yeah, it was uh, it was obviously it was it was tough tonight. Uh, you know, no excuses, man. Give give Boston credit; they they played great. You know, they were well prepared, and uh, you know they they were the better team tonight. Okay.